creating a new job in SureCount. There are actually two ways to create jobs in SureCount. The first way is to create the job in IntelliBid, and then from there, to import the job into SureCount. Let's see how to do that. We'll start from the Job Register screen in IntelliBid. We click the New Job option from the toolbar, and then we enter a job name, which we'll call Forever Pets. Then click the OK button. We then add more job details under the Job Register tab. We'll enter an occupancy type. This example job is a pet hospital, so we'll select Hospital. We'll enter the square footage. If we know who our job estimator is, we can check off the name of the person that's estimating. Then we select a bid due date. Once that has been set up, we need to open SureCount to bring the IntelliBid job into it. From SureCount's file menu, we'll select Job, and then we'll click the Add IntelliBid Job option. SureCount then shows all jobs that are in my instance of IntelliBid. We'll just scroll down until we find the job that we need. A prompt appears asking if we want to activate this job in SureCount. We do. So let's click Yes, and then OK. Now that job comes into SureCount. Next, we can add the drawing related to this job. From the File menu at the top of the screen, let's click Drawing, and then select the Add Drawing option. A window appears. From here, we'll click the Add Drawings button. Then we'll select the job that we want to place the files into. We can bring in more than one file at a time. Click Open and then click Save and Close. Then we can see those drawings are being added into this Forever Pets Pet Hospital job. The second way that we will look at adding a job in SureCount is by creating the job in SureCount first. To do that, we'll start from SureCount. We'll navigate back to the file menu at the top of the screen and then click Job, and then the Add Job option. We must enter a job ID, which can be the name of the job, and then a job description. The job description can be the same as the ID or something different. We'll just make it the same by copying the ID and pasting it into the description field. Then we click OK to finish this step. Now that we've created this job, we need to move this job back over into IntelliBid. Before we do that, let's go ahead and add our job's drawings. Go back to the file menu, click Drawing, and then click Add Drawing. In the window that appears next, click on the Add Drawings button. Then we go over and find the drawings that we want to bring into this job. We'll select the three drawings shown, and then click Open, and then click Save and Close. The drawing import process begins, and we'll wait until it completes. Now the drawings are in this job. OK. As mentioned before, this project is still only in SureCount. We need to move it into IntelliBid, so from within SureCount, we'll go back up to the top file menu and click Job. Then we'll click the Save as Current Job option. A window appears, and from there, we can give our job an ID and description. We'll make both the same thing. However, before we click OK, we need to select the Save as IntelliBid Job option and then click OK to proceed. Then we get a notification that says we're going to have to set up our phase assignment, and that's fine. We'll click OK, and then we'll click OK again in the Add Job window that appears. Now, when we go back into IntelliBid, we must refresh our job registry to see the new job. We'll click the Refresh icon in the IntelliBid toolbar, and then we can see the Flambeau building job listed below. At this point, we could set up the phase tree in IntelliBid, or we could go right back into SureCount and start our takeoff from there. Thanks for watching this Conest tip video. Like this video and subscribe to our channel to get more tips and to keep up to date with Conest software systems.